had such a good night because like after the film he took me out for pizza. I mean, Darren never buys me anything. Well, I'm glad you had a good time. All right, Sarah, how are you doing? Oh, I'm all right, Sam, how are you? Good. He's well lush, so when are we going to get introduced? Candice, he is like 20 something. And anyway, you've already got two boyfriends. I don't even think you could handle three. <laughs> you want a bet? <laughs> So when is this car ready for its maiden voyage? Well, a couple of weeks yet, I think. Um, he's promised me and Candy uh, the first ride, haven't you, Sam? What? No way, I thought I were first. Well, I reckon your mum deserves first dibs because we out her. I couldn't have done any Ooh, of this. Oh, leave me out of it. Right, well, I, I see your tea's ready, so best be off. Oh, no, you can stay if you want. Mum, you always do too much, don't you? Uh, well, it's only sausage and mash, but you're welcome if you like. Oh, cheers. Is, is that OK? Of course it is. Unless you have to go to your other job. I heard you're a stripper. <laughs> yeah, that's right. So, do you keep your kecks on or do you do the full Monty like? <laughs> Mum, tell them. Sarah would love to see you doing your stuff, wouldn't you, Sarah? Please. <laughs> All right, girls, pack it in. Sorry, Sam. I think you've got a couple of admirers. <laughs> I mean, the one thing I love about Todd is he's dead mature. I mean, he even bought my chips. Oh, wow. He really knows how to show a girl a good time. And he's dead clever. So what's he doing going out with you then? Anyhow, I don't even know if we're going out. Well, not officially, anyway. Oh, well, if it doesn't work out, you can always stay with Darren. He's just a big kid. Hiya. Hiya, Todd. Hiya. So, are you going to walk us to school then? Might as well, I suppose. Hang on a minute, I've got something in my shoe. You know, you can walk ahead, Sarah. We'll catch up in a minute. to interrupt you eating. I was just passing. Hello, sir. Hi, Audrey. Oh, well, now, isn't this a nice change? I always think a table looks better when you've got a man at the head, huh? You're welcome to join us, ma'am. There's plenty. No, 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 thank you. I wouldn't say no to a cup of tea, though. This is gorgeous, Gail, as usual. <laughs> I don't know where you put it, Jill. Yeah, you don't get muscles like that living on cheese and crackers, eh, Sam? <laughs> I made spaghetti last night, didn't I, Sam? Yeah, better than out you get in a restaurant. Oh. Well, I love to see a man enjoying his food. I can't bear fatty eaters. <laughs> well, there's no fear of that with Sam. <laughs> well, um, and have you got no one special at home to cook for you, Sam? I I'm on my own these days. Bit of a disagreement with me, ma'am. What you need is a good woman to look after you. That's what you need. <laughs> <laughs> Leave him alone, ma'am. Sam enjoys his freedom, don't you? Too right. Yeah, and the longer you hang on to it, the better. Oh. Can't see anything. No, I gave him one. Well, couldn't you think of anything to talk about? Well, he enjoyed it. Well, did he say so? No. Oh, well, maybe he was a bit stunned. To tell you the truth, he was a bit slow. Or he was a bit pushy. No, I've been out with loads of lads and they tried on more than he has. Yeah, but you don't have to jump on him on the first date. What are you saying? Nothing. Good, because you're in no position to judge. 